You need a financial advisor with the freedom to focus on your specific needs. Whatever your goals, Reed Potter can create a game plan tailored to you. Call Reed at 432-0777 at Pikeville, Kentucky to learn more. Two weeks ago, the Floyd County Animal Shelter was overcrowded and facing potentially having to euthanize animals. After hearing this, the community rallied to save the lives of these dogs and cats. In the past two weeks, we've had 28 get adopted. Um, that's cats and dogs. We've had just as many leave us on rescue. We've had several rescues reach out to us and pull as well. Um, we only have a handful of cats and just a couple dogs left to choose from. Rescues from Ohio, Michigan, Minnesota, Illinois, and several other states have reached out to the Floyd County Animal Shelter to help these animals find homes. The community has also donated their time and supplies. Um, we've had several people come in. Um, Foxy Fitness is one way to get some exercise. They come and walk dogs for us. Um, we've had, today we'll be getting a donation in from a daycare, actually. Um, so, you know, businesses can just set up a corner of your office and take in donations and drop it off at the end of the week. We appreciate it so much. There are still several long-term residents of the shelter that need homes. Jade, she is a female black cat. Um, she came to us really scared, so she's learning to accept. She's, she, she's learning to be a cuddle bug. Um, she gets, from what we can tell, she gets along with everybody. She just has to have somebody who is patient. Um, as far as dogs goes, I've got Gus Gus. He's been here probably just a couple months less than her. However, he is dog aggressive. Um, if he, there is no dogs in the home, he is a sweetie. If you are interested in donating to the shelter, the most needed items are paper towels, kitty litter, Dawn dishwashing liquid, and canned and dried dog and cat food. The shelter also accepts monetary donations. All the money right now is um, going towards our new shelter. And we're, our goal is to build a new shelter that can house a few more um, than what we have right now. Um, like I said, this building was built in the 70s, so it does need updated. The link to donate is on their Facebook page at Floyd County Animal Shelter. For Mountaintop News, I'm Brianna Robinson.